Hi, I am Dr. M. Joe Kaushik, gynecologist practicing in Nagar Koil at Carolyn John Hospital. Today we will talk about the shockwave therapy. What so first we should know what is shockwave therapy. It is a low intensity sound wave energy which are put in your corpora to increase the penile vasculature and increase the penile blood flow. So the second most important thing which people used to ask me is, so what are the conditions in which the shockwave therapy will be useful? The first important thing which we should understand is, this shockwave therapy will be useful in case of vasculogenic erectile dysfunction. So what is vasculogenic erectile dysfunction? It is basically there is a redu reduction in the function of your penile artery. So this kind of erectile dysfunction because of the penile vessels we call it as vasculogenic erectile dysfunction. The second most important thing where the shockwave therapy will be useful is Pyronis disease. So what is Pyronis disease? The Pyronis disease is produced because of any injury to the penile tissue which usually causes fibrosis of the injured area which is similar to the scar which happens inside your penis and later on it will cause a bend to your penis so that you will have pain during the sexual activity or else the penetration only it will be very difficult. This can happen in case of diabetes or else other comorbid diseases also. So in these cases the shockwave therapy are extremely useful and it is a non-invasive way of reducing the plague formation inside your penis. So the third thing what, what we should know is how does this shockwave therapy acts? It basically causes neoangiogenesis which means there will be a increased peripheral vasculature how many sessions are required for this treatment it basically exactly it depends upon your penile arterial function it is what we do is we used to analyze it based on the pulse wave analysis and the endothelial function test which reveals us how much the in dam how much the damage to the penile artery has happened so usually we prefer minimum 8 sessions or in certain cases 6 sessions only will be more than enough or in, in certain section certain cases people will require 10 sessions so the most common number of sessions used is from 6 to 8 so when you will start to feel the improvement this sessions will be done over a period of 2 to 3 weeks so usually after a period of 1 week there will be a improvement in your erectile function so this improvement it will be start it will be growing on growing on till six weeks at that point of time you are complete that new angiogenesis process would have happened so usually the improvement starts at one week and till six weeks there will be a better improvement in your erectile function and how long does this effect loss last this effect usually lasts for around 18 months to 24 months in al almost all the patients but if you are not having any comorbid diseases or your diabetes or your cholesterol levels are under control means this can be extended up to five years because we had personally seen the patients who had not uh, found any difficulty in having a penetrative sexual activity after the shockwave therapy they had not had they had not had any complaints after even after five years and they had never required to use any viagra like kind of medications also so the next common thing is what are the side effects of shockwave therapy first we should understand that this is a non-invasive totally painless procedure which usually does not have any side effects because we don't use it in your urethra, we just use it in your corpora. So, in these cases, the only possible side effect which we had seen is that some of the patients wouldn't have got the required improvement. So, according to me, the shockwave therapy 
I had never seen any side effects and there is no reported side effects also in this kind of treatment. So the last thing is whether shockwave therapy is a fact or it's a myth. So I had explained to you what we had we are doing and what we had seen with the shockwave therapy results. So this shockwave therapy is having results up to 70 to 80 percent in each and every patient so that it is not a myth and it is the true thing which is getting more popularized in the regenerative aspect of andrology especially treating erectile dysfunction thank you